All right, what's up, beat makers? What's up, hip hop fanatics? Uh, this is Vintage with True Substance. Today, I'm going to show you a couple methods on um, syncing your MPD MIDI controller to the Slice Sex so that you can play Slice individually on the pads. You can you can assign it to the pads that you want to trigger these uh, these slices on instead of just receiving the default um, programs for your for your MPD. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and uh, load a sample into the slice X. All right. See here now I'm going to go ahead and uh, right now um, I'm playing the MPD there's nothing being triggered there's nothing planned with the slices because I don't have it configured yet so the one method that I'm gonna show you how to use is to go to this icon here well first I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and fix you know fix configure these pads so that it will play as a one shot um, so I'm gonna so let me show you how to do that first real quick I'm gonna go here to uh, this feature called uh, freeze and then I'm gonna um, click on the arrow and then I'm gonna go to uh, hopefully you all can see that I'm gonna go to uh, open state file and then I'm gonna click on the, uh, the it's gonna be it's gonna bring you to the envelopes folder and I'm gonna click on the uh, the value sustaining uh, F and V um, function here. So it's going to say sustaining. So I'll click on that. Now, now I can go ahead and, and uh, when I go ahead and configure the pads, it should play each slice on a, as a one shot. Um, so that way I can just hit the I can hit the pad once and it'll, it'll play the entire slice through to the end. Now to configure the, the slices to the pads that I want on the MPD I'm going to select this icon that says ABC and then I'm going to go to assign trigger notes to all okay so what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the last the last it says last hit I'm going to select this it says last hit and then I'm going to play each pad uh, after to each slice, I'm going to sign each pad to each slice by hitting the pad. So I'm going to hit push last hit. I, I, well, no, I'm going to hit the pad. I'm going to hit the pad that I want to sign it to. Then I'm going to hit last hit. Then I'm going to hit the next pad. Hit last hit again. Hit the next pad. Last hit. Hit the next pat pat, and it's gonna go. It's gonna go through all the slices until it's done. Now, I can go ahead and play the pads. So that's that's one method of how you can assign on um, all your slices to to each pad on your MPD. Another uh another method that I've learned. How to do this is to go into um, let's see here I'm gonna I'm gonna open up a new I'm gonna open up a new slice X channel okay I'm going to get out of this get out of this all right I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing I'm going to put a sample into this new slices channel. Okay. All right. Now, let me go ahead and uh, sustain it real quick. Select freeze. Let me go up to the freeze button here. Click the arrow. Go to open state. And then uh, select value, volume, or velocity. I think it's velocity. Sustaining. I'm going to select that. And that way, when I hit the when I hit the pad, it'll just it'll hit it'll play it on one shot. 
uh, continuously to, to an ends, to each sample ends, or each slice ends. Now, to assign it to uh, all the pads using an, another method that I've learned, um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, X out of this slice X. Wait a minute, let's do this over again here. Okay, not X out of it. I'm going to just take the uh, slice X and move it down. And then I'm going to go to the channel settings. And here on the keys, where it, where it starts off at a C5, like it all, the default setting always starts with a C5 when you're playing your samples and your sounds through the uh, channel here, through the channel settings. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take that C5, I'm going to move it over to C3, and right click C3. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, left click and uh, from C3 to C5 so that it's highlighted. So, so what, what's happening is when I select, when I make that selection, it's selecting all of those keys that I want to play um, through this slice X. After I do that, I'm going to click on the miscellaneous and I'm going to click on this button that says add to key. Hit that. Now let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and play the slices again. Pull this up. Wait a minute. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. There we are, and that's that's uh, those are the couple methods of how to assign uh, all of your slices to your MPD pads. Thank you for tuning in. Check me out at truesubstance.com, true-substance.com, and uh, keep it moving, meatheads. Keep it moving. All right.